So you think your Microsoft account has been hacked? Here's what to do. The first thing to do is to try and log back into your account. This should be done by heading to www.microsoft.com. Do not try to log in via any links or texts you receive, as these were most likely sent as part of a phishing attack. Step 2. Changing your password. This step can only be completed if step 1 was a success. If you've logged into your Microsoft account, go straight to the password settings and change your password. The main reason the hacker got into your account is because they cracked your password, so changing it means they will be unable to cause any more damage. Once you've completed the previous steps, check for any changes that may have been made such as the payment methods or your contact details. Hackers may change these details in order to verify their use on their account, so if anything looks different, be sure to revert the changes. Now here's a step that's crucial you don't miss. Whether you've managed to log into your account or not, you must contact Microsoft support. Letting Microsoft know about your issue means they could possibly help you. They can check for activity and changes the hacker has made that you might not know about. Also, if you have been completely locked out of your account, they can help you regain access. Step 5. Change passwords to other accounts. Come on now, own up. Most people feel it's a good idea to use pretty much identical passwords for every online account they own. However, if hackers know one of them, they'll try that on all other accounts, meaning you'll lose access on a lot more than just your Microsoft account. And finally, keep an eye out on your account. Hackers may have done something you don't know about, so if any strange activity continues, we recommend repeating all the steps in this video.